بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم الحمد للہ وقفا و سلام علا عباد نصطفا اما بعد قال اللہ تبارک و تعالی فل کلام المجید و الفرقان حمید بعد اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم یا ایو اللہ جن آمن تو اس کو اللہ ذکر کثیرا بس سب ہو وہ بک رہتا ہوں وہ اصیلا خالہ رسول اللہ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم ول و آنی ول و آیا ایزن خالہ رسول اللہ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم کلمتان حبیبتان علی الرحمن خفیفتان علی اللسان حقیفتان علی الزام سبحان اللہ و بحمد ہی سبحان اللہ العظیم صدق اللہ مولانا العظیم و صدق رسول النبی الکریم و نحن اللہ ظال کمن شاہدین و شاکرین و الحمد للہ رب العالمین اللہ صلی علیہ سیدنا محمد و علیہ آل سیدنا محمد و بارک و سلم و صلی علیہ ربش رحلی صدری و یسر علی عمری محلقہ تمی لسانی یف قہ قولی ربی ذدنی علما سبحان کا لا علم لنا اللہ معلم تنا ان کا انت علیم الحکیم حضرت مفتی صاحب علماء کرام صوفیہ کرام میرے محتر بھائیوں بزرگو دوستو السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ برادرس گادر سٹنگ ہیئر انگلش ان شاء اللہ ٹاک انگلش لینگویج لیٹس برنگ آور ہارٹس اینڈ آور مائنڈ ان دا اسٹیٹ آف شکر اللہ سبحان و تعالی بلیسڈ اس وتھ دا ہائیسٹ گریٹسٹ بلیسڈ بلیسنگ آف المان الاسلام اس عادت بزور بازو نیست تا نہ بخشت خدا بخشندہ اس اونلی دا کرم اینڈ فضل اینڈ بلیسنگ فار اللہ سبحان تعالی وی آر مسلم وی شوڈ ویلیو ایٹ وی شوڈ بی پراؤڈ آف دیر بینگ اے مسلم ہو ول نو دا ویلیو وین دا ڈے آف قیاما There will be no accountability for the kuffar. Command goes straight to Jahannam. Accountability is for the Muslim. So we should do shukar. Walan shakartum la azi dannakum. If you do shukar on any ni'mat, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala keep up that ni'mat even. He will increase the name of also, name of Al Iman, Al Islam, Wal Ama. So I often, in my Juma Khutbah, I tell brother, sometime in a week, maybe preferable fixed Friday, we should try to make two rakat nafil shukr on this name of Al Islam. Then what will happen? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will keep us blessed with Iman. And there's a very hope that our last breath should be with Iman. Man kana akhira kalami la ilaha illallah dakhla jannah. Whose last sentence will be la ilaha illallah, he will enter jannah. This should be our goal. They are the purpose of these majalas. Especially Asr time is a special time for the Zikr Allah. <coughs> I quoted ayat before you. O believer, do Zikr of Allah in abundance. All ibadat have limit. 
सलाद फाइव हज वन फर्ज एफ रमजान ट्वेंटी नाइन और थर्टी जकत टू एंड हैव परसेंट सो दिस वेरी इबादत जिक्र अल्लाह हैज नो लिमिट बट अनफॉर्चुनेटली इवन नाव डेज मुसलम उम्मा नॉट होल सम इग्नोरिंग दिस इबादत इमे डोंट थिंक द जिक्र अल्लाह इज ए इबादत एंड द नेम दिस इज अ जॉब ऑफ द सूफिया कुरआन डज नॉट मैंशन द वर्ड सूफी कुरआन मैंशनिंग एंड कुरान मजीद कमेंडिंग टू हू या अयोहलाजिन आमन ओ माई बलव बिलीवर ओ माई बिलीवर डू जिक्र अल्लाह इन अबंडस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टेक आउट आवर माइंड दिस आइडिया विच शैतान पुट इन द माइंड द जिक्र अल्लाह इज फॉर सूफी पीपल नो And sometimes he plays the trick. You read the Quran and Majid is also zikr. Of course, Quran and Majid also zikr. Of course, Salat is also zikr. Of course, each and every good amal we do is a zikr. But to get this achievement, this goal, Quran says, "Wa sabbe hu bukra tum wa asila." And he said, "Pak, I quoted." And Buhari Shri Brahmatullah Lai Muhammad Ismail Muhammad bin Ismail Buhari Rahmatullah Lai he quoted this hadith at the end of Buhari Shri. Pala Matanet two words are very, very beloved to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. These two words. Are very light at the tongue, but in the reward, are very heavy in the scale. Subhanallah, wa bihamdihi. Subhanallah, lazim. Please repeat it. Subhanallah, wa bihamdihi. Subhanallah, lazim. Beautiful. cost nothing so much so this ibadat of zikr is recommended in abundance therefore the least condition of this ibadat imr wuzu par ek no problem preferable the wuzu if no wuzu we can still do zikr allah subhanahu wa taala subhan allah especially asr time rasul akram sallallahu alaihi wasallam you to do istighfar 70 mara 70 time or 100 time is kam adhi mafhoom in the hadith se pak rasul akram sallallahu alaihi wasallam himself doing istighfar it means in addition to all meaning of quran is a zikr salat is a zikr to sit down for a while remembering of allah subhanahu is a zikr ya rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam why are you doing istighfar you are masoom ulama karam Answer this question. The Surah Al-Kam Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was doing istighfar for the education of the Ummah, so that we, for the sins, my Ummah may do istighfar, and istighfar is the prescription 
to delete the sins. My umma get his sins forgiven, so that my umma enter Jannah easily. New da new day start at a certain time. So Prophet Salla Sir commanded us, we should do a hundred times istighfar after Asr Salat. Let me tell you, my brothers and my elders, our goal should be to enter Jannah very free with the mercy of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. The Muslims, Mormon, have two way to go to Jannah. One direct and one indirect. Direct Jannah or via Jahannam Jannah. The second option, easy to say and easy to hear. But we cannot afford this option via Jahannam, Jahannam, go to Jannah even one second. May Allah want to save us. Now how should we achieve this goal? To achieve this goal, first of all, we have to take our last breath with the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And our effort with La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. If during the lifetime, if we do this zikr of La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah maximum, then it will be very easy to say at the time of deathbed. Elder recommended. Morning hundred times, evening hundred times. Do the zikr of La ilaha illallah and your sheikh, your spiritual teacher, how he taught you to do zikr La ilaha illallah. I will not go to Google and start doing 1,000 times morning, evening, or 5,000 times, you will see there. If you read this, Ten thousand, this will happen. Do this zikr eleven thousand times, this will happen. You stand in the water, do this zikr, this will happen. No, I will not do that. I will go to the special teachers. Before making salat, we have to learn salat. Before doing to doing hajj, we shall learn hajj. Zakat time, we shall learn how to pay zakat. What is the first on us? Is the first to learn that also. But it's sunnah. It's sunnah to learn on us. So we have to learn to how to do zikr from the specialist, Mashaikh, Ulama Haq, Muftiyani Haq, how to do zikr. But simple zikr is very no problem. Third kalma, hundred times, morning, evening. Istighfar, hundred times, morning, evening. Drushif, hundred times, morning, evening, minimum. But Drushif is such a zikr, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala himself involved. Inna Allah wa malaikatahu yusalluna ala nabi ya ayyuhallazina amanu Sallu alayhi wa sallimu taslima. Subhanallah. Inna Allah wa malaikatahu yusalluna ala nabi ya ayyuhallazina amanu sallu alayhi wa sallimu taslima. No doubt, surely Allah swt himself and his angel sent salavat wa salam blessing on Hazrat Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. O believer, you do also. This such zikr. This is Rabbi Yul Awwal, especially in this month we should do more zikr. 
Friday we should do more zikr of Prophet said, Friday we should do more zikr of the Rushif or Salvat and Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Beautiful. Every zikr has different beautiful impression on the heart. Special qualities. So, listen. Rushi, for example, Salvat an Nabi, this zikr has very cooling effect. Very cooling effect. If you are upset, start making the Rushi. Angry, start making the Rushi. You'll be all, all set. Even in the Arab community, we have noticed it and they certify it. This is a very common habit. If two Arabs, brother or sister, have little argument and third brother say, Sallu al Nabi. So both start singing Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa Ali Muhammad. The quarrel cool down no more. True? Yes. True. Yes. No, yes. yes or no? Yes. yes, he said. He certified. Zikr. If they do zikr, la 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 la, it will prove more. With the hot zikr. Every zikr has their own effect. Therefore, I advise uh, in my bayan and lecture of how uh, to tarbiya of the children, our family, happy family system. I advise the children when you see your dad and ma arguing, so go to ma, ma, salu al and go to dad, salu al and the mom and dad, when they start saying Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa Ali Muhammad, that quarrel, argument will cool down. It's a good prescription I am giving you. Teach your children or teach your sweetheart. Honey, when I'm angry, say, advise me, sallu ala nabi. Understand? And when she is very angry of our misbehavior, we should advise her, Salluan and Nabi. This is a very good prescription. Love of Rasulullah will grow in the heart by this zikr. And Shafate Nabi, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, we will enjoy. Kurbe Rasul will enjoy. Some Mashaikh, you to do zikr of Salvat al Nabi in a special number, regularly, they do due to get ziyara. There are certain Salvat, if you do those zikr in a certain number with proper etiquettes, you can get the ziyarat. Of Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam easily. A prophet said, "Who did my ziyarat? I do shifat. He will be with me in the jannah. And our prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam is hayat. Our akida, his hayat. But his hayat, we do not understand." So, another zikr there is an istighfar. That's beautiful. The zikr of istighfar, with the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, put in condition, will guarantee you to go to Jannah straight. How? Listen carefully. It is recommended. We should do istighfar morning, evening, hundred times, or whatever time your shaykh recommended you, or you feel easy. As Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, you to do istighfar after a certain time. This sunnah also, this ibadat also, 
the hukum also we should do it let me tell you frankly what thing will stop us to go to enter janna right away that will be our disobedience our sins related to khaliq related to makhluk that will stop us so we have to keep clean the hukukul ibad we have to keep clean hukukullah but still but still there will be sins left over first of all we will try our best to pay all hukukullah to our best ability all ibadat salat hajj zakat all these and try to pay hukukul ibad rights of the dad and mom rights of the aulad wife children family employee employer imam masjid even the hukuk of the disbeliever we will try to fulfill the rights but still left over what should we do we are human being bachar we should do istighfar but i will not only depend on morning and evening istighfar example i commit sin not knowingly it happened from me at zohar time this is example very carefully i will not wait for isha i will do istighfar 100 time i may face israel alayhi salam at the time of asr right that sin is pending the what the medicine is this so i commit any sin first of all we will not commit any sin but it will happen because we are bashar therefore soon any sin happen from us we should do toba right away we should do toba right way we should not wait we should try to pay the haq of the other hukuk ul ibad as soon as possible no delay why because death has no calendar the conclusion we should try to keep our soul free from sins every minute every second why the death has no calendar so i want to see israel alayhi salam when my soul is free from sin that my goal so that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala his mercy soon you put me in the grave he open the door of her paradise that our goal you understand how to enter janna how to get our last breath with iman this is khatma bil iman the job of the ear is to listen job of the eyes to look job of the tongue to speak a job of the heart to do zikr allah very easy 24 hours can do it before i sleep i will recommend myself to you also we should do self evaluation before sleeping self evaluation 
muhasaba go whole day over the account what good deed i did do shukr on that so next day wala nishkartu la azidannakum allah subhanahu wa ta'ala next day will, will give us more tawfiq to do more good deed and what i did hold a bad thing later to makhluk seek forgiveness from makhluk before sleep don't wait until tomorrow morning angel of death can come in the night time do istighfar after doing istighfar few time with of course we speed with the wuzu right side istighfar after that start to zikr la ilaha illallah muhammad rasulullah three five time then continue saying la ilaha illallah la ilaha illallah la ilaha illallah in the heart and sleep it will help you also having a very sound sleep we sleep i was doing zikr i slept the whole night will be counted in the zikr allah and if while sleeping angel of death come then you tell me what was the last sentence bolo bhai la ilaha then hadith e pak says man kana akhira kalami la ilaha illallah dakhal janna whose last sentence be la ilaha illallah he enter janna and say brother therefore we should morning evening we should fix the time all other ibadat has time so we should fix ourselves to our easiness to our program morning even fix the time don't do general don't do general thing okay sometimes they no 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 this is spiritual food zikr allah is a spiritual food we eat three time physical food right ru need also food ru need every minute food we should fix special time also after tahajjud after fajr after isha which is easy for you you understand here fix the time first what your sheikh recommended you zikr do that if not ulama karam normally says four tasbihat tasbih istighfar ayyu istighfar astaghfirullah 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 rabbi min kulli zambin wa atubu or any other istighfar with atubu alayh very good because in this atubu alayh i promise i will do again so any istighfar we should do 100 time morning 100 time evening third kalma 100 time morning 100 time evening drushi 100 time morning 100 time evening zikr o la ilaha illallah muhammad rasulullah kalma tayyiba 100 time morning 100 time evening But now I tell you how to do it. Then we close. There are two ways of doing zikr. One highway speed, one local speed. Highway speed, you may get accident, violation. Understand? Example: highway speed. Subhanallah, 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 and 
walking in the street, walking in the masjid, subhanallah, alhamdulillah. Astaghfirullah, 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 astaghfirullah. This is high speed. It's good. Something better than nothing. Please. If you're doing like that, la 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 la, do it. Don't stop it. Something better than nothing. It will benefit. But not too much. If we say, make salat, understand the meaning. This salat will change the life. In the salat atanha anil fahya banukar. So what should we do? We do the zikr with local speed. How? Subhanallah. Alhamdulillah. La ilaha illallah. Wallahu akbar. Wala hawla wala quwwat illa billah. Hil aliyya lazim. Ar subhanallah. Subhanallah wa bihamdihi. Subhanallah hil azim. Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa barik wa sallam. Astaghfirullah. Astaghfirullah. This is the local speed. When you do this with local speed, think about the meaning. When you do the zikr of la ilaha illallah, our third kalma, we should remember the ihsanat, the favors of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When we make the ruhishif, we should, in the mind, remember the favors of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa Understand? Our tongue should do this zikr, and heart should think about the meaning. Heart and mind in the meaning. And doing istighfar, at the time of istighfar, what should we do? We think our sins. In the heart saying, Ya Allah, forgive me. For the heart say, forgive me, Ya Allah. Let me tell you, if the person say, hundred times after Asr, Astaghfirullah, and with, the, with thinking, Ya Allah, forgive me. Ya Allah, forgive me. Tell me now, hundred times, try it. They tell me, how will you feel? Hundred times we say, as a time, Ya Allah forgive me, I will not do again. Ya Allah forgive me, I will not do again. Ya Allah forgive me, I will not do again. What will happen? No organ of the body will dare to commit any sin. Try this. But some students complain to me, Hazrat, we cannot do it. It takes, it takes a lot of time. The way I am teaching you to do zikr, with the local speed, it will take me half an hour, 45 minutes. You understand? Then I recommend them start from 33 times. Then slowly, slowly increase it. Slowly, slowly increase it. Because Islam in the deen, quality mm. is counted, not quantity. Understand? In Islam, quality is counted, not quantity. Then you feel the difference. Any problem come up? Let me know. Let your sheikh know. There are so many kinds, there are a lot of benefit of zikr. I cannot continue. Lot of benefit of the zikr. There are so many kinds of zikr. Zikr al with the tongue. Jahari, Jahari and Siri. Loud voice, Allah, Allah, Allah. Or you say, La ilaha illallah, La ilaha. This is also very good. Don't object it. Some shaykh do it. Some ulama do it. Sufiya do it. Don't object it. The loud zikr is a medicine for so many diseases. No objection. Be watchful. Zikr jahar, zikr siri, and zikr kalbi. Zikr with the heart. One of that zikr is a muraqba, meditation. 
and meditation zikr is the best medicine for anxiety and depression i have tried on so many patient they stop eating medicine i taught them muraqaba meditation zikr e qalbi zina bashaikh mein this in the quran majid was kuris marabbi ka wa tabattal ilaih tabdila such ayat are the base of this zikr zikr e qalbi in some other meeting inshallah i teach that also muraqaba the best medicine for anxiety and depression now before i close as i mentioned before after asr salat prophet sala you to do istighfar 100 time so please i myself yourself i request you please low your head do 100 time astaghfirullah astaghfirullah 100 time then i will make dua inshallah please low your head do 100 time istighfar this is sunna after asr salat 100 time استغفر الله ربي من كل ذنب واتوب الى الله وصلى على محمد وعلى محمد كما صليت على ابراهيم وعلى ال ابراهيم انك حميد مجيد اللهم بارك على محمد وعلى ال محمد كما باركت على ابراهيم وعلى ال ابراهيم انك حميد مجيد ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنه وفي الاخره حسنه واقنا عذاب النار ربنا هب لنا من ازواجنا وذرياتنا قرة اعين واجعلنا للمتقين اماما يا الله مر جرمو کو معاف فرما لکشوں کو معاف فرما جان کی مال کی عزت کی آبرو کی فاطمہ یا اللہ ذکر والی زبان عطا فرما اپنی محبت عطا فرما اپنے نبی کی محبت عطا فرما یا اللہ والدین کی محبت عطا فرما قرآن مجید کی محبت عطا فرما اہل و عیار کی محبت عطا فرما مومنین کی محبت عطا فرما یا اللہ یا رحمہ یا رحیم رحم کا معاملہ فرما کرم کا معاملہ فرما یا اللہ خاتمہ بل ایمان 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 فرما ہمارے جو اکابرین دنیا سے رخصت ہو چکے ہیں ان کو جنت الفردوس عطا فرما یا اللہ جو زندہ ہیں ان کو بھی جنت الفردوس عطا فرما ان کو لمبی حیات طیبہ عطا فرما یا اللہ امت کے تمام بیماروں کو شفاء کاملہ آجل عطا فرما ہم سب کے تمام روحانی جسمانی بیماریوں کو شفائق عطا کاملہ عطا فرما یا اللہ ہماری دعاؤں کو 
محض اپنے فضل و کرم سے رسول اکرم صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم کے قربانیوں کا صدقہ صحابہ کے قربانی صدقہ قبول فرما دین کے جو جو محنتیں مثبت محنتیں یا اللہ ہو رہی ہیں یا اللہ ان کو خیروں سے نواز دے ان کو ہر شر سے محفوظ فرما یا اللہ اس مدینہ مسجد کو آباد فرما تا قیامت اس کو آباد فرما یا اللہ اس کو اعمال سے آباد فرما یا اللہ ہماری دعاؤں کو محض اپنے فضل و کم سے قبول فرما سبحانہ رب کا رب العزت اما یا سفون و سلام علی المرسلین و الحمد للہ رب العالمین و صلی اللہ تعالی علی خیر خلق ہی سیدنا محمد و آلہی و اصحابہی اجمائین برحمد رجال